guys, this is Brandy, otherwise known as Mystery Diamonds, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hey y'all. Okay, so I have an unboxing from Diamond Art Club. I saw this and I had to have it. Like, you know, there's those images that you see and your body says, I need it. Like, I know that I don't need another diamond painting, but I need this diamond painting. If those of you that know, you know what I'm talking about, right? Please tell me that I am not the only one that is like sees an image and it doesn't matter that I have like however many I have. I don't even, I don't even have a number for how many I have in my stash, but it doesn't really matter because I, I want, I want more. I see them and this is one of them. So I cannot wait to get in and show you what canvas I got. All right, so I went ahead and I got the canvas out, um, kind of laying it sort of kind of semi-flat. My my desk is not big enough to contain the whole thing, um, and so I will have to end up taking it into my room uh, to show you the full image, but oh my goodness, like I said, just, I mean, like, like, just look at these colors. Look at these colors. This is why I had to have it. Okay, so... This is what your kit comes with. You do get a sticker sheet that has your colors. You have a pamphlet toolkit. You have a small sticker for either your box or your uh, diamond painting journal, whichever way you choose to use it. And you have your drills and your canvas. And y'all, a Diamond Art Club canvas is so soft. Like, um, it's just like, they just, they, I don't know, it's buttery. I don't know how else to describe it. I love their canvases. Okay, so... Um, we'll go ahead and do this first. So everything comes with a, uh, pamphlet that tells you like what all's included in your kit, tips and tricks. You have your thank you code. If you've never diamond painted before, you can go here and watch video. You can get these instructions. And once you purchase, you can join the VIP Facebook group. Um, I am a Diamond Art Club affiliate, and so, you know, if you've never purchased from Diamond Art Club before, you can use my code right here, Mystery Attend. You can get you $10 off if you've never purchased, but y'all, once you purchase, you ain't going back. I'm just telling you right now, you, you, you will, like, you won't be able to just get one. All right, so I, because the smaller sticker, she's just not going to show it justice. I'm just going to put that to the side back there so that you can see the big one. Which one did I get? Which one? Which which which, which one did I get? <gasps> Look at her. Look at this. <laughs> Rainy Day by Hannah Lynn. Like, y'all. Oh, my God. These little, these little duckies. They got me. They got me. And these, this little lamb with the little galoshes on. <laughs> like, I couldn't stand it. I had to have it. <gasps> oh, my goodness. So, this entire thing is a sticker sheet. She is a square. 65 by 88. So, she's not tiny. She, she's actually fairly big. Um, she has 67 colors. 67 colors. And so... Um, with Diamond Art Club, if this number is up underneath the number 150, it's an AB. So she has one, two, three, she has three ABs, a pink, yellow, and a green. And then down here, Z3865, I do believe that is a fairy dust. So she has a fairy dust in her as well. I'm really curious to see which ones. I love that you have the start and the end date. Now, with the toolkit... Everything is the same in every toolkit, um, whether you get round or squares. Honestly, the only difference between a round and a square are those right there. The murder tweezers, okay? The stabby McStabbers and tweezers. Y'all do not be doing nothing. Y you people that are out there doing stuff with these tweezers, don't go do stuff. Like, y'all, these are not the tweezers to go pick out your toenails with, okay? You will hurt yourself. Don't go, no, and, and don't go trying to take stuff out your skin either. These are not those kind of tweezers to do that with because they are sharp and they do hurt. So keep your... Uh, the sheath on them when you're not using them, but these are perfect for picking up drills with. I do love using my tweezers. And you do get um, multi-placer. You get a pen. This time I got a pink pen and a pink squishy. The squishy, and of course, you know, normally it doesn't work with me on camera. So, yeah, she's, we're just gonna, we're just gonna wiggle her on. She goes all the way on, but we ain't working with it today. We have baggies. We have our um, tray that does have a stopper in it so that you can shaka shaka. You have a thin four placer and a thin seven placer. I've started using 
this little seven placer and so I do love it you get your heart shape wax just make sure you get two of them in there make sure that this plastic that is on it you pull that back and you you know you that way you can get to the actual wax and then this is what is definitely unique in each one now like I said if you have a round you will not get these okay you only get this if you get a square so you have a cover minder this time I have a pretty little like dusty purple rose and it does have the strong magnets and you get washi tape and so this time this is my washi tape gives you a pretty good amount too. love that with flowers makes kind of perfect sense with this canvas I've got all right so let me put this up and we're gonna look at the actual canvas all right are we ready to see her I'm ready to see her oh <laughs> y'all Hannah Lynn's work just makes me smile oh my gosh just look at the rainbow colors of that umbrella and I love how you've got the black and white polka dot up underneath look at her hair and those gorgeous eyes y'all even these clouds with the with the sunshine coming out and she's holding a little duckling I'm telling you and her little um do they call that a Macintosh and like I call it a rain jacket but like don't they call it Macintosh in a different land or, or am I done I may be dumb y'all I may be dummy foamy and then you got these cute heels back here and these pretty flowers but y'all this is the part that got me okay this is what made me go I have to have it look at these cute little ducklings like oh my god look at this one look at this one he is splashing around in that water for all who can see him he's just like I am I'm doing it y'all I'm doing it and this little lamb with these little galoshes, these little galoshes on his little feet. I don't know what's happening to my canvas here, y'all. It said, it said, no, thank you, ma'am. Oh, Mike, and then this little duck, like, okay, so the duck is waterproof, y'all. The duck is waterproof, but what does it got on? He's got a little rain hat on that matches that little umbrella. Like, how? Oh, my God. And, like, look at her galoshes. They have ladybugs on them. And they both have these little, like, black and white. She is matched. She is matched with her, her fellow creatures. And I just, y'all, I couldn't help it. Not only that, but this, one of the reasons why I was super excited to get this is because I wanted to unbox it and announce we are at, we are getting ready and geared up for Hanathon. Okay, for those of you that do not know what Hanathon is, Hanathon is a twice a year event that myself and my friend Beth from Shine Like a Diamond put on every year. I'll tell you a little bit more at the end of the video. So let's finish looking at this canvas and then we will get into the nitty gritty details of the event. Okay, so let's look at the drills. Are y'all ready? Before I look at the drills, they do have the name on the drills in case you store them separately. I always keep mine with my canvas, um, but that's because I know myself I will lose them otherwise. So, are we ready to take a look at these colors? Let's go down to Crinkle Town. Crinkle Town, ready to go. Oh my God, these colors just, oh, they just, they're so gorgeous oh my god they're just like yeah they're they're like <laughs> taste the rainbow except trust me on this you don't want to taste any drills um because they don't taste good and they hurt your teeth uh unfortunately i, I speak from experience because y'all i use tweezers whenever i diamond paint and um, especially on my squares and every now and then they do go pinging and one went pinging in my drink and didn't realize it yeah uh-huh so anyway huh, enough of story time <laughs> All right, so we're going to go through these drills, and I'm going to go ahead and give you my little warning. When I do these drills, I speed up the footage and editing so that when I do, I kind of sound like a chipmunk, so I call this chipmunk mode. Now, if you are one that does not like chipmunk mode, that is okay. You can either mute the video and just watch the colors go by, or you can fast forward to the end. You'll actually know that you're in chipmunk mode because up here we'll have a little chipmunk picture. And when you no longer see that chipmunk up there, you know that chipmunk mode has ended. So 
once again, if you are one that doesn't like to watch it, you can pay attention to that little chipmunk, fast forward, whatever your heart desires. But I get a lot of people um, that that do love chipmunk mode. I get new people in here. Uh, this is just kind of my way of doing something a little different. And I enjoy it. I make myself laugh um, when I'm listening back to it. So anyway, y'all ready to strap on your boots? Y'all ready to get going? Let's get going. Ready? And chipmunk mode activated. Okay, so we're, you know what? I'm going to start off with these two. That, oh, all, 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 all by themselves. Oh, all by themselves. Y'all, oh my God, those, those are packed. Like, you can smack it back to them. These are packed. Look, we already have our first AB 130. AB, the yellow. Mm -hmm. Yellow. Whew. Okay, so I'm hoping you can see this. Y'all, I'm so excited. So, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, and it means there's this iridescent coating on the top of the drill. Show it to them, guys. On the top of this drill, and it means when the light hits it, it shows all these different, like, colors. Um, you know, sometimes you'll have some little blues, purples, yellows, oranges, reds. And we have two. Not one, not one, not one, but two. Two. Two of them. Okay, I gotta stop talking about that. Oh, my God, two. Oh, mm. okay, now let's get into the others. So, we have 701-996-666. We've got a big bag of 666. <gasps> Y'all, here's our second AB. 135. Don't fuck with it. They are just insistent on going, you know what, Hannah Leah needs to be blinged out. Let's go ahead and give it to her. <gasps> That's like a chartreuse color. Yes, thank you. Okay, 995. Okay, now let me just explain right now. If you got a Hannah Leah, you got some free tin. Because we do highlight, or not highlight, it's not called a highlight, Brandy. For goodness sake. Snap, can you talk? Outline. It's called an outline. She outlines her characters. Lord have mercy. I'm a teacher and I can't even talk, for goodness sake. Okay, let me try that again. So, you're going to have a lot of black, but I'm telling you, I'm one of those. I want to know in the comments, are you one who, whether you color or diamond paint, and it has an outline, do you outline first and then fill in the color, or do you fill in the color and outline last? I, personally, am an outline first and then color in. I, I've always done that, whether it's my coloring or my diamond paintings. So, let's see how many three tins we've got. One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, that's not bad. Six, three tins, not bad at all. And, oh my, what the blazes? Son of a biscuit eater! Okay, y'all, y'all, no, just, oh my lord, smack me and call me auntie. I just, wow, okay, y'all, okay, 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 I can, I can do this, I really can. I was gonna tell you there's a lot of white, um, in this canvas. Do you see that symbol right there? Z3865. Do you know what that means? That means these are the fairy dust, and because they're light colored, I know that that is not gonna show. Oh, I wish it would show. Oh my god, okay, so, so, if you don't know what fairy dust is, it basically has this matte, mica, blah, 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 blah. I'm so surprised I can't even talk. It has this mica powder inside there, and so it's not like glitter, but it has this really cool shimmery essence, but I really wish you could see it, but you really can't with it being so light colored. And there is, wow, okay, this is the most I've ever seen in a painting. There's one, two, three, four, y'all, four! Four packages of big fairy dust. Who do you see? You're killing me and in a good way. Okay, okay. Um, y'all, mm -hmm, uh, half of y'all have probably tuned out by now because I just lost my ever-living mind. I'm sorry. Okay, I am back with the, the world of the living, I swear. Whew. We have two of the 3823. We have 327. Two bags of 3846. Oh, my goodness. Get your fairy dust self down there. Oh, my Lord. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have 699. 3837. We have two bags of 703. Two bags of 165. We have a 762, 972, two bags of 906, one pretty bag of 947. We have a 415 gray. We have two bags of 3845. That's very pretty. Ooh, I like it. Oh, my God. And my camera is just not doing it justice. 958 is this gorgeous teal color. It's, oh, it's gorgeous. 445, 819, 741. And here is our other AB. 124. Look at that pink. And that's a decent amount, too. 444. So I just, I can't get over. Oh, my Lord. Someone's going to have to take me to a, mm-mm. Okay. 704, 453, 963, 318, 3766, 740, 208, 414. That has some, there's a brand. You are not in your right place, sir. Mm-hmm. They're going to get you, and you're going to come out there. 977, 3856, 817, 490. Come get, come get, get out of there. 498, 890, 939, 209, 3608, 892, 30, 40, 30, 48, 826. Oh, my goodness. Okay, one more bag. I'm going to have to use the big container for this one. Okay, so we have 3708, 3848, 3847. They look very similar, right? But they're not. They're, look, look, you can actually see on my camera. They're slightly different, but they're gorgeous. Teal and purple. Look, oh, the teal and purple play together. I love it. 210, 779, 825, 317, 824 with a little hanging outer dude. 3756, 352, 3799, 413, 3607. Y'all are all... Everybody is partying with everybody else. Shame on you. Y'all are supposed to be at home. 813. 351, 814, 211, 162, 712, and 775. Y'all, I, I cannot even right now because this is one of the first times that I've seen so much of all of the special colors. They, okay, let's take a look at where these go. All right, so let's kind of do a little bit 
of a flyby on her. Oh my gosh, she is so gorgeous, y'all. Oh, look at these colors. Like, that's one of the things I love about Hannah Lynn are these colors and them little duckies. Look at them little duckies running and playing. All right, so let's look at the whole image. Look at her right there. Gorgeous. All right, back to the video. Okay, I'm kind of really glad that I, I, I like to go through and do a little uh, figure out where all the ABs are before I tell y'all so that my head's not all in the camera. And I'm so glad I was not recording during that because... Lord have mercy, the words that were coming out of my mouth. I mean, they were, they were not cuss words. I was not cussing, y'all. But I was, I, y'all, mm, okay, let, let me just, let me get down to the nitty gritty here. There's a reason why we have, what was it, four bags of that fairy dust? That's because this, okay, well, first off, let's, let's just go ahead and get this part out of the way so that y'all can see it. So, they have scalloped and surge edges for, uh, so you don't fray. And your drill field is real clear. Do y'all see that little dot right there? Do you see that dot? That dot is that fairy dust. And let me just explain something to y'all right here, right now. Everywhere you see that bright white, and I do mean everywhere, the rain, around the clouds, these dots, all, all of that. We're not done. We're not done. Look at them dots. Them dots, the rain, the rain. You think we're done? No, we're not done. Here. All that white that's there, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. In the duck, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. In the lamb, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. All of that's that fairy dust. All of that is that fairy dust. Yeah, um, and we're not done. We're not done. Because remember, we also have a lot of that yellow. Mm-hmm. Um, how about yellow in the duckies, in the galoshes, more the duck lens. We also have yellow in his little tag. We have her, her rain jacket, whatever you call it, that bright yellow, uh-huh, yep, 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 that's that AB. Also, y'all, I can't even talk right now. I'm like, I sound like a buffoon a Luna, but I, it's just, I, they, I have, uh-huh, mm, string words together, Brandy, string words together. Um, this yellow in this rainbow, is it? And, uh, in here has that yellow, and, and, this little duckling and in the umbrella. Um, and then we also have that number one and the number three. So where you see these pinks in the cloud, there are some of those ones going along there. And are there any other ones? Did I, did I say, look, I got so excited looking at those fairy dust that I, I like actually, I, I don't know. I lost myself. Yeah, I think pretty much. Your pinks are up here in that pretty sky, and those green are the other, um, uh, the other bag, the number three, those greens are in these little spots, these patches. Those are all those threes, that color, that green chartreuse medu colors are going all throughout. Oh, no, that's, yeah, right there. That's five, Brandy. This is the three. Um, so, like, they... Oh, just wow. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Diamond Art Club, you... Woo, you... See, see, they know I like to bling up my Hannah Lynn, and they said, here, here, let me give you a hand. I think that's what happened. Oh, mm ha -hmm. Okay, I have gotten my... I think I've gotten myself together. Y'all, I just... I don't even know. I, I don't think I've ever been so speechless on what all came with the canvas in my, like, ever since I've been un un uh, mm -hmm, uh -huh, unboxing. Okay, so, Brandy, stop talking like an idiot, and let's get back to what, what, uh -huh, what we're trying to do. I'm sitting here trying to think of if I want to add more additional stuff, like I think I do, but I, I'm so, like, thankful for everything that comes with it. I just don't even know. Oh, okay, so, um, they do have a, a uh -huh, legend list over on top. And down here on bottom, oh my god, y'all, I can't even, they threw me for a loop. I didn't think I could actually be thrown for a loop. So, um, now, let's talk about real quick, if you are, Hannah Lynn's, like I said, because she does a lot of this outlining, that's why you have um, so many of the blacks, but it really does make her pieces pop, and I love that, and I love that the fairy dust is outlining all of the, the light-colored spots, so that makes it, like, really, really cool looking, too. Um, but, 
I look, I even lost my train of thought. What in the what were you trying to say, Brandy? I swear you were I was try I was saying something. What was I saying? Hold on, let me see if I can figure it out. I, I'm back. I'm not sure where the train went. The train went off without me. Um there's no engineer in the in the caboose or some or in the in the engine. So let's just <laughs> I'm good. Um let's go ahead and talk about Hanathon. So Hanathon, like I said, we do this twice a year. Um, we always do it in October, and the other one is in April. So I will not actually be starting this canvas for October because I have a more fallish, Halloweenish one. Maybe I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out exactly what canvas I want to do, but I do know I want to hold off on this one until April because you know April showers bring May flowers kind of thing, and so I kind of want to hold off on this one until April. Um, and I'll put somewhere probably in my community tab or on um, Facebook page uh, asking a poll for what canvas do you think I should do because they're all so wonderful. I have one that I'm fixing to unbox that I'm very likely to possibly do. Now, so what is, like I said, what can you do for Hanathon? As long as you have a licensed, if it's diamond painting, you have to have a licensed Hannah Lynn image. Okay. Um, and so... As long as you have a licensed image, does it have to be a new start? No, it does not have to be a new start. Um, but you cannot have more than 50% already completed. Okay, so if you've got over 50%, I'm not going to be able, Beth and I are not going to be able to let you uh, use that canvas. Um, the only thing that has to be a new start is if you are doing her coloring pages. Because if you don't have a diamond painting, there's also cross stitch. If you don't want to do the cross stitch, then there is coloring. She has coloring books. Or you can go on her um, page and you can um, buy individual uh, coloring pages. And you can print them out and color them. So all we ask with the coloring pages is that one does have to be a new one each time uh, fresh start new one um, to be able to count just because coloring doesn't take as long uh, we will have we have a Facebook page called Hannathon and I will put the link down below um, and so I know that this is beginning ish middle ish of September hence why I want to make sure I get this out there so that y'all are gearing up and getting ready get your handle lens out if you already have them if you do not have them go get some like I said you can participate with the uh, coloring um, and we do have uh, Diamond Art Diamond Art Club is sponsoring um, as one of our sponsors, and we're so happy with that. Thank you so much, Diamond Art Club, for doing that. But we also have other sponsors as well, um, and so you'll have to stay tuned to see what kind of cool little giveaways that Beth and I will have. Uh, we will have, like, um, lives and all that. I might even do some whip and chat. I haven't figured that part out yet if I'm going to do a whip and chat. It all depends on my time uh, that I have. But we will definitely be doing lives and we will definitely be uh, posting in the Facebook group so that that's where we will be counting your points. Hopefully we will be able to have some cool little activities that we will do along the month as well. Um, there was something else. Let's see. License. Oh, um, you... In the past, we've done a Google form. Um, I do have to check with Beth to see if she still wants to do the Google form. But I will tell you that if you win, you will need to uh, contact us and be able to give us information to be able to get your prizes to you. So keep that in mind that we will need to uh, get up with you. So be paying attention if you win. Um, this only goes for the month of October. It is all month long of October. So like I said, if you have a Halloween, if you got a, it doesn't matter what kind of a Hannah Lynn that you have as long as it's licensed and you just want to come have fun and celebrate the art of Hannah Lynn. Beth, this is Beth's favorite artist. It's one of my favorite artists. I absolutely love her girls. I love her images. And so I am super excited. I was trying to think if there's anything else that I can think of. If you have any questions um, about Hanathon, you can either contact me or you can contact Beth. Um, and we'll be more than happy to... Oh, now I remember what I was going to say. 
We'll be happy, by the way, to answer your questions. I wanted to finish that statement. But I have remembered what I said. I have been asked by a few people, can you do the mystery Hannah Lynn? And let me answer that. The answer is yes. However, however, there is a specific way that you're going to have to enter her. Okay. In the start and your progress pictures, you're only going to be able to show me in the thread a picture of that sticker sheet with the big question mark. The reason why is we don't want to spoil this image for other people. And you're going to go, well, how in the world are you going to know what progress I made? Because you're going to have to then separately email me your, and I do have my email down in the description, you're going to have to email me your progress each week. Um, because I already know, because I'm a bad girl, I already know what the image of the mystery painting is, so you're not ruining the surprise for me. Um, I only want that uh, question mark in the thread, number one, so it doesn't spoil the image for other people, and number two, so that when I am counting up entries, I do count you and I don't forget you, okay? But I will go back and check that you have sent me the um, email with your progress picture. So hopefully that will answer any questions if you have about if you have the mystery handle in and you want to do it for the event. Um, like I said, if you've got any questions, please contact me or Beth, and uh, we'll be happy to answer y'all. So I hope that y'all are getting ready for Hanathon. I know I am. I'm excited. I'm going to get together my uh, canvases to be able to get y'all's opinion on which one do you think I should do. Because this one, this one I'm doing in April. I, I already know this one. This one is being saved for April. All right. Well, that's all that I have for you. I hope that you've enjoyed this video as crazy and rambling and weird as it was because I lost my ever living mind. Um, but thank you so much. I'd, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up because <laughs> it really does help the channel. And if you're new and you haven't subscribed, I hope I haven't uh, ran you off. But uh, if you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe and come join my crazy Diamonds family um, with me at the helm. <laughs> but just make sure that you hit that bell icon for all notifications. That way you know anytime that I go live or anytime I upload a video, <laughs> as weird as it may be, <laughs> I'd love to uh, hang out with you guys. And all right, I'm going to leave you like I always do. Reach for the stars, grab hold, hold on, and never let go. Until my next video. <laughs> Bye, guys.